never carried around this much money before. I still can't believe you made six hundred and fifty-three dollars. And fifty-three cents. Waterproof electric motors. Aren't they spectacular? They're small, they're powerful, they're two hundred and ninety-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents. Times four? One thousand one hundred and ninety-nine dollars and ninety-six cents. I'll go get change for the bus. No. We're not giving up. Wait a minute. What if we get a bunch of tiny motors and just hook them up together and cluster them together? Okay, fine. What if we just get one of these motors and... Trolling motors. They gotta be strong, all right? To move boats. And they're cheap as hell. We can buy four, and then we can hack off the poles. Well, they're a lot larger. I mean, we need more metal to fill the frame. It says they gotta be metal. Great work, guys. And twenty dollars. Uh, sir, you're still short four hundred and thirty-two dollars and fifty-four cents. Um, what if we got rid of these? Whoa! Sorry. Um, we can't do anything without the fuse panels, or the microcontrollers, or the batteries, or the laser tape measure. It'll run without the laser tape measure. Dr. Cameron, if we don't have the laser tape measure, uh -huh. then I don't think... We we'll figure it out later. Can you remove the laser tape measure? Thank you. Uh, you are still short 134.63. Can I borrow your pen? I thought you couldn't donate. It's a robotics contest, not a fundraising contest. Besides, who's gonna know? Oh, hey, and my man ate a couple ice creams on the way in. Can I have an ice cream? Too late. I already wrote the check. 